hey hi everyone uh, this is prashant here uh, welcome to my channel so long time no see so today is we are going to start with playwright series actually uh, even i know selim and cypress i don't know uh, like playwright at all seriously so i thought to study so then i said okay we will study with everyone together so i am i'm going to spend every day 15 minutes uh, this entire course is like every day 15 minutes only it's like i plan for 20 days uh we'll see how it's going the uh, how it's going step by step uh, in the center uh, process okay so first of all we need to know what are the things we need to start installing first thing we should have a python in our system next uh, we should have a editor so editor basically is a and like something like suppose you're writing a word document now you need to write notepad right so similar to that to, to type python play right we need some editor so we are going we are going to use a pycharm actually that is a good in market so many people are using pycharm then after that third one the main thing is we need to install the playwright in our system so let's start so first of all how to download a python so simply go to the google and python download so see this is the first website python.org so just open it and uh, you can download and you can you can download it so so simple and after downloading click on next 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 button that that's enough uh, let us just 3.11.4 i don't know when you are seeing this video it may be a uh, new version but no but the thing will change much okay once you installing this so how to verify uh, you have this you know, if you are using mac now open a terminal and type python iphone iphone version if you are using windows windows means open the command prompt go to the start and uh, open the command prompt type uh, python py, uh, python iphone iphone version so it's not showing so uh, for for uh, windows now you can simply type python but for ios you need to type python 3 so that's more important okay so if you install a python it automatically comes next thing you need to verify is pip is there or not so pip is uh, python integration package like mostly you need to download all the libraries of python from pip only okay so we need to if you automatically installing the python pip will included in that so you don't have to worry okay once you have successfully installed the python so i am using 3.10.7 na so even it is older compared to 3.11 uh, so next thing is you need to install the pycharm so pycharm is one of a good editor in this market like intellij na so intellij also comes under same jet brains only so once you go to the uh, pycharm so you can simply uh, download the community version like you don't need to have a professional version professional version is paid one so we don't need community version is enough for us and if you are using windows na uh, select the windows and click on download the community version if you are using mac means you can click the mac os and click on download if you are if someone is using linux means thank god you can guys can click on the download as well okay uh, so this is a uh, once i uh, downloaded just click on next next okay so that is a thing and third thing so here we need to install the playwright so how to install the playwright so uh, for that simply you can go to playwright playwright okay so playwright is official uh, moreover i always says if you are studying any tools or technologies go to their official websites there only we can get a, a like latest updates because suppose i am taking a video in 2023 and after two years this video or this entire process may differ so always prefer to go to their official websites in their official websites uh, so uh, this is the home page of the website okay uh, click on the get start button so here also there but i cl- i went to get started with the library so what are the libraries we need okay if you are using python i am select python in the drop down so if you want to study in java also we can study the playwright okay so but i am uh, started using python because i am almost cross 6 years in java i don't want to be in java much that's why okay um, and these are three commands first is you want to verify the pip is our latest upgrade that's why the first command is if you are installing the python just now na you don't need to upgrade the pip because you already have a latest one so next is the main thing is pip install playwright that is the first thing so if you are running this pip install playwright it will download the playwright in your system okay see this it started downloading it will take couple of seconds or something so i already downloaded uh 
even so i'm getting some error or what hmm. there are so many things is there building greenland project did not run successfully uh, exit code i will do wheels proper error sub uh, process exact with the error okay we can install the playwright inside the project that will make our uh, work simpler okay okay i will i will install these two things let it be so first we will create a project so for that i need to open the pycharm editor so in the pycharm editor i need to click on the new project okay so we are going to open a new project now so the pycharm is taking time okay so if you are click on the new project once click on the new project the new project page will come i am going to give like python youtube series series series, series. okay series um i just like will create a python project generally simple it don't have anything just have one main dot py file and that's it only has okay. so this python projects is created so as as uh, for testing purpose it will create a main dot py so py stands for python extension so what whatever python file you creating na you want to put a uh, file name dot py okay so next thing as i said here you want to click on the terminal below see this uh, in the below you can see the terminal so i click on the terminal button in this place and right now i'm going to run that command which command pip install playwright okay so it will take couple of minutes see this is successfully all the things are run okay because if you are installing the uh, playwright in the system level na systems have so many security concerns na so but inside the projects we initially this playwright is only for this project okay after that even i learned later only you want to install the playwright install okay after installing the playwright from the pip you want to install the this playwright so this playwright why we are installing na it will install the browsers those things okay so we done successfully it will it will take couple of minutes it will download the your chrome firefox browser na it will download it will takes time okay so uh, first time i'm going to create a new some on python file so i'm right clicking on the project I'm going to new and click on the python file so i'm going to name it like hmm, chrome browser launch chrome browser launch so i'm creating one this is empty file so in this empty file first thing you want to import okay so from playwright dot so in playwright there are two kind of things in there in playwright even the same document will teach you if you scroll down the document there are two things one is sync one is asynchronous what is synchronous mean generally normally if you are or oh, we are through two thread means since synchronous the second thread will wait until the first thread completes the work and second thread will execute next but in asynchronous process if you are having couple of threads it will run independently without depending on each other so but we don't need to much know about this in beginner level let it be so we are just now start with sync next class coming classes we will use asynchronous as well so from this i am going to import some i'm going to import some like uh sync playwright okay so this is the import like generally we'll import in all the classes using this only we can implement all the things so inside we need to say with keyword so with is a keyword like it mention a function with sync playwright i'm going to uh, like example p is enough like we are mentioning like it is a playwright something okay first we need we need a the browser b r o w you, you can give any name like this is a variable only okay so browser so i'm going to create a browser playwright dot so sorry we need to use if we using p means chrome dot launch okay we are launching the chrome browser first after like manually after launching a browser next thing is you go and type the url right the same thing we are going to do 
so i'm going to create a new page so from the browser dot i'm going to create a new page like this is a new page actually so after creating a new page after uh, the new tab is comes now so after that that i'm going to i'm going to some by url so we need to use a go to method to go to url so what i will take now i will take some google websites so you need to copy the url from here then in the quotation you just paste it so right now we are going to the url okay so to verify this so what we can put now we can simply print for printing we need to use a print statement in python so i'm going to write um, chrome successfully opened okay uh, like right now writing something so i'm right clicking right click on anywhere you can just run this project so if you're running so see this it's successful run but you can ask me prashant i didn't see the browser at all yeah this happened same for me then i browse it so what this you want to do now you want to say headless right now defaultly what is happening now in the play right it 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 is at as problem of running in uh, headless headless means you cannot see the screen in front end but the script is running back end so so what you, i want to do now i want to make headless equal to false so if i make it as false now right now you guys able to see the 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 so scheme now so it is so the cool thing even i learned before this video only okay next thing is to for testing purpose suppose you need a title of this page means so i'm simply printing the title so page dot so what we need i'm typing t so if i call title means it will take the title of the page so page uh, basically what is the title means the, the in this page google so if i keep a cursor on the stop of this place now what is coming google is coming now so this is the title suppose i am keeping in gmail means is inbox is the title of the current page okay so this is all suppose you want to wait for the browser now so you want to use page dot wait timeout so in this timeout it will take the milliseconds so if i give a 3000 means it's calculated as a 3 seconds so i am making you to see the long says the seconds see this it's like about 3 seconds after that it will close okay. so for my even generally how we close the browser na we will uh, close the browser or uh, uh, browser dot sorry browser dot dot close so it will close the browser for my system i have i don't know what i'm doing it is automatically closing so this is how the basic play right the normal will do every day we will see 15 minutes of the classes maximum 15 minutes even i started learning playwright last month but you know right after 5 5 days we are not able to continue the study so i thought this time okay i will start uh, like a series for at least for series i will study na so i will i will i'm i will study i am posting some videos in whatever in the entire uh, uh, series as a as a beginner i am also new so i am also putting the video if you have any if you have doubts na please put in the comment uh as most of the time i will try to reply or uh, we will uh, next videos i will try to uh, answer your questions okay so we will study together or well, thanks for joining in if you like the video please subscribe and share to your friends okay we will meet on the our next video bye